everyone, this is Curly Tiffany's Nature Gloss plus Self Care Reviews. And I have gone down to the Dollar Tree and I am going to be doing a Dollar Tree haul. I found some really, really, really cool looking items in a Dollar Tree that I just had to try. And I'm going to share those with you guys. I'm going to be doing this in two parts. This is just going to be for the face, the item products that I found um, in their health and beauty aisle for the face. And then I'm going to do a part two, and that's going to be for the items that I found for their body and also for their feet. Yes, they have products in there for your feet. So I'm excited about trying these, reviewing these, and sharing these with you guys. And I hope that maybe there's something in here that you will enjoy as well. So let's get into it. Okay, so the first item I'm going to be reviewing is the Collagen Cleansing Cloths. And I'm gonna put a picture up. Now I'm going to open these up and I did put on a little bit of mascara and a little bit of eyeliner. I'm not a huge makeup person, but I do wear it sometimes. So let's see how these will work. Okay, this is what they look like. They don't really have a smell. There's no smell. It looks like it's a nice size sheet. Let's see how big it is. So I'm going to wipe my face and see if this will take off any of the makeup that I have on my eye. There's no smell. Now to compare, I'm trying to think what I can compare this to, and I have bought the Philosophy. Um, I, I do love Philosophy. I don't think I've done any reviews, uh, shared any, any reviews on those yet, but I do buy the Philosophy cleansing cloths, and of course they're not a bug. This seems to be coming off pretty good. You can see the cloth. So it is taking it off. And I like them. You know what a good idea would be for these, especially in the summertime, is to stick these in the refrigerator and whoop them out when you want to wipe your face you know when you get sweaty and this would be a nice cooling cloth as well and it's only a buck this feels really good collagen cleansing cloths for a buck and it did, it took it off. I'm just gonna go through my lashes. So it did, it took off the makeup that's on my eyes. I didn't have a ton on. I didn't have a ton of makeup on. But I had eyeliner and some uh, mascara. It looks like it took it off pretty well. So, I like it. And this right here, I believe you get 20. I believe there's 20, that's enough that comes in here. But you can see how many that you get. Pop these suckers in the refrigerator, pull them out, put them back in here, and you can have some cold cleansing cloths. So, I like it. This one is a good one. I like it. It's a box. Now the next Dollar Tree item I'm going to be reviewing is the gel eye mask. And I'll put a picture up. 
Now the instructions for this is to put this um, in the freezer for an hour. I don't know if you can see that. I'll try to put the to put this in the freezer for uh, in the freezer for 10 minutes or in the refrigerator for 60 minutes. So I had this in the freezer. I just threw it in the freezer. So I'm going to open this up, and this is the gel eye mask. Oh yes, it's nice and cold. Okay, so this is what it looks like, and it looks like it comes. Oh, okay. So this part right here, it looks like it actually goes over your face. Look at this. Oh wow, that feels really good, you guys. No joke. It's nice and cool. So then you just take the strap and just strap it on. Oh my god, that feels really good around my eyes. And I do have baggy eyes. Oh, oh, yes. Oh, I love this. Guys, this is nice. It feels really, really good. I like it. So I put this in for, like I said, like 10 minutes in the freezer. And it feels really good. This right here, if it's nice, it's, it's nice and tight. Let's see if I wanted to go to bed with this on. I don't see how that would be a problem if my pillow is here. I don't think that would be a problem. Oh my god, I am loving this. I I I oh, oh my goodness, it feels it feels good. It feels really good. Love it. It's right here up under the eyes, and it feels like if you have like that puffiness, like I have puffiness right under the eye. This may be something that will help. Will it help? I don't know, but I can tell you it does feel good. I feel it right here, up here, for the coolness all the way around my eye. Ooh, it feels good. I like it. Dollar Tree for a dollar gel mask. Check this out, you guys. I love it. Yes, 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 yes. I love it. It, it does. It feels good. It's not uncomfortable. It's nice and snuggy once you put that strap on. And it's adjustable. I love it. It feels really good. Like it's right up under there, right up under those eyes. So I would probably leave this on until I just couldn't stand it anymore. But I'm gonna tell you, it's comfortable. It's not uncomfortable at all. It's it's not uncomfortable. I it is comfortable. So I would probably just leave this on until it doesn't feel cool anymore or until it just felt uncomfortable. So I love it. A dollar. And a dollar tree. A cooling gel mask. I love it. Two out of two. It's a dollar. You know, after I took that off, I still feel the tingly. I still feel the coldness of the mask. I, I'm, I'm putting that on tonight. That's going on tonight. I absolutely love that. Now, the next product we're going to review, this one is called the Under Eye Massager. Dollar Tree Under Eye Massager. So I am going to open this up.
and this right here could is probably something that you can put in the refrigerator too. So here it is, the under eye massager. And I'll put a picture up. And it just goes right up under your eye. Now it says that um, putting like a a cream or your eye cream. So let me go get my eye cream. I should have brought my eye cream. I'm just patting it around my eye. I'm gonna go get my eye cream. And it says um, to just roll it around your eye like this. I'm gonna go get my um, some face cream. Hold on. So what I did is I went ahead and just grabbed my milk, my Josie milk. And I'm just gonna put it right above, right below here. Just a little bit. And you know what? I think that this would be nice also. I said that already? Also nice in the refrigerator. So the ball doesn't move. It doesn't look like the ball moves. So I'm just going to go up under my eye this way. And this feels good. And I think this would feel even better if it was put in the refrigerator, if it was in the refrigerator for a little bit, just to make it nice and cool. But the ball itself, it doesn't roll. You do all this, um, all this rolling manually, and it feels good. And I, I know that it will feel even better. Hold. So this is a good way to go to use your eye cream and massage your eye cream right up under your eye. Make sure it gets right in there, right in your skin. But I like it. Oh, wait, 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 I took that back. The ball is moving. I just felt the ball move. Hold on. Oh, the ball does move. I take it back. It does move. The ball does move. But it does. The ball does move. Maybe um, it just took a while, or maybe it's the the moisturizer that's on my face. It's helping it moving. You can hear it. So the ball does. The ball does move. Let's go right up under your eye. Under eye massager. For a buck. I like it. So the next Dollar Tree product I'm going to be reviewing is the, they call this the under eye and lip mask. I have never seen this in a Dollar Tree before. So, but like I said, I, I when I go in there, I kind of like just walk past them. I never really pay any attention. So, um, I'm glad that I took a look. Look at this. Okay, I'm just going to peel it open. Carefully, I'm gonna peel this open, and it feels wet here. Let's see what it looks like when you open it. It looks like there's it's wet in here, so there's maybe some kind of solution. Okay, so it comes out jelly. It feels jelly. You know, it reminds me of the. Um, the bologna face mask that I just did. If you guys didn't see the bologna face mask, um, I will um, leave a link below so you can see that. But that's what this feels like. It feels jelly. It feels jelly like the bologna face mask. So there is some type of gel that's already on here. So I am going to go ahead and and I'm sure that is so it will stick to your skin. Oh, okay, and be careful because my nail just went right through there. So it is really thin. Right 
And this would be something that I think I would put in the refrigerator too, why not? To give it a little bit of a chill. Now Peter Thomas Roth has come out with some under eye gel masks that people are just absolutely going nuts for. When I get a hold of them, I am going to surely be reviewing those. But right now, this is the Dollar Tree haul and So, the gel that they have on here, it does, it does allow it to stick pretty good. And, but the, the actual pads, the, the actual pads are like gel. So, um, if you're going to use this, you're going to have to be careful. I feel like I can't seem to get this one exactly where I want it. Because it's really thin and like I said my nail has already gone up going through there so that's that and then they have this for your lips look at this you can see it's really hard oh no nope, my nail just went right through it it's hard to hold on to it because of the gel the um, the gel that they have, some kind of gel that they have that's on here. So this will go on the lips. Is this gonna go on my lip? Okay. Let's see this one's going on. It's not gonna stay on my lip though. So the eye gel patches, they stay on, but the lip doesn't stay on. There is some kind of slit right here, but I'm not going to mess with it. Here, you can, you can kind of see, see how thin it is. You can stick, I mean my nail is like going right through there, but it's not going to stick. I don't know, I can go with that. I don't think that's worth it. That's not very comfortable. So this one, this one is not going to be one that worked out that well. And you can see these are already slipping off. It's a good, it's a good idea, but it just doesn't stay on. Like I said, these would be nice if they were cold. You stick them in the fridge and put them up here, but they don't stay very long. So. The lip um, didn't work. It doesn't stay on. These stay on a little bit. And if you lay it back like this, of course, it just stays on a little bit. And I don't know if that's what this is supposed to be for. If you are, um, if you're supposed to just. Mm -mm -mm. So. The lip part doesn't work that well, but the, the, the gel patches work. If I was going to Dollar Tree, I wouldn't pick this back up again. All the other items so far, I would. So this one didn't work out that well, but if you want to try it, I would suggest to um, stick it in the refrigerator and get these a little bit cold and it'll feel really, really good up under your eye. 